a recently named uh, on the lot impact trophy watch list for this year. So we have outside linebacker Cam Good questions for Cam. If you have them, please put them in the chat. I know someone's got to have a question. All right, we'll start with Tra Travers from Rivals.com. Y'all are forcing me to talk. How's it going, Cam? It's good. How about you? Pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, yeah, uh, you said you're nominated for the Lod Trophy. In general, how does that feel, and how does it feel to have gotten back in full pads these past couple of days? Uh, it's definitely an honor, and it just makes me more hungry to want more and actually try and win the award. But um, – it feels great being back at practice since I wasn't in there during the spring. So it feels good uh, getting back into the swing of things and feels like normal again. And it sounds like you're going to have a new running mate on the opposite side at the outside linebacker position. How's it been kind of working with, you know, uh, Braxton and Oren and some of the other guys who can play that spot? Uh, it's real fun working with Braxton. Uh, he, he really uh, studies his stuff and, make sure he gets the little details down and he's and he uh, works really hard and I really appreciate that and I feel like we'll be a good little duo. All right, next up we have Jackson Moore from 24-7. Yeah, uh, Cam, just away from the field, more so maybe in the locker room and as far as leadership goes, just what's it been like for you not having Tevin there and what your role has, how has changed uh, as a senior in that group? Uh, yeah, it's definitely different uh, being the only older guy besides maybe Matt Horowitz, who's a year younger. So I definitely feel like I have to step up and be more of a leader, lead by example. Also uh, help out these younger guys learn the defense more and giving them all the knowledge I have. Thank you. Uh, next up, we have Jim McGill from Bear Insider. Hey, Cam, what's the uh, vibe like on this team compared to the uh, the others that you've been on at Cal? Uh, the vibe, I see a lot of young, hungry guys. Um, yeah, so I feel like everybody is really uh, trying to build uh, chemistry because we got younger guys stepping up, and uh, it's just forcing us to really communicate more, and I feel like that will be real beneficial moving forward. Cam Biden was saying that, you guys largely feel like you have the talent where nobody should beat you this year. Is that kind of your mindset too? Oh yeah. We always feel like that. We definitely feel like we should run the pack this year and we're really excited. We got a lot of talent. We got a lot of guys that work hard. So yeah, we'll definitely be excited for this big season for us. Does, uh, does coach Wilcox ever let you guys talk about the Rose bowl? Uh, we don't do too much talking about the Rose Bowl, Amara. We just take it one game at a time, one day at a time. And, yeah, that's the ultimate goal, though. We we do have that in the back of our mind, though. Got it. We'll go back to Trace Travers. Yeah, Cam, ha has anything really changed scheme-wise from year to year for you, or – is it still the same? You're, you know, you're the what Coach Druder called the glory position at the outside linebacker spot. Yeah, not not much has changed. Still working a lot of the same techniques, still doing the same things. So, feel that feel like that's real helpful and let me just uh, hammer those things down. Make sure I get the little things on those and just keep building my knowledge on the defense. And I feel like we can just uh, keep getting better from here. Yeah. And with the – you guys are playing next to a young defensive line where there's not as much continuity. How have some of those guys looked in the early going of uh, fall camp here? Oh, they look real good. Um, I'm excited to see it. And we got some, some freshmen, some big guys in there. So, I feel like we got a, a, some good depth at position. We also got Ziande, an older guy, to help lead them. So, I'm feeling real strong about that position and happy to have them there. Have any of the true freshmen stood out there? Um, I feel like both of uh, both of the freshmen have done a good job, and yeah, so I don't know. We'll see. Uh, we'll go back to Jim McGill for another question. Yeah, I'm watching a lot of the early season games. 
there's a lot of really sloppy tackling going on out there. Like there's been a, a lack of fundamentals because of all the craziness of the time off and coming back real quickly. But Coach Wilk, or Coach um, Sermon was talking about how important tackling is to what you do as a defense. Do you guys feel like that might give you that that edge being sound in the fundamentals there? Oh, yeah. Tackling is a big emphasis. And usually you see a lot of missed tackles in week one and, and this year more, more uh, especially because – just the whole situation. So yeah, we make sure to emphasize that, and we've been slowly uh, getting into getting into the fundamentals of that. So I feel like that'll be a definitely be a strong suit as we get to the first game and all that. Thanks. All right. Uh, and if there are any more questions for Cam, I'll give it a couple more seconds. You guys put something in the chat. Doesn't look 